Ahoy! Today's video is going to explain a few interesting and seldom known things about spirit points. In one of my earlier videos I used an SP potion to refill the yellow bar when doing a test and lots of people were wondering why I did that. Well here's why. When you activate a battle mode or aura, you don't always get the same amount of stats as listed at the description of the skill. As you can see now, my damage output is different for the hits with BN3 activated at different SP values. To be honest, it's really not a big deal in terms of damage and defense, but Earth Aura, for example, gets an additional 2% of critical rate if activated with large amounts of SP, and that can make a difference. Another thing that lots of people don't know is you recover SP not only while dancing, but also while using attack skills. This only works when you don't have any battle modes active though. There are also some tight spots where you cannot dance due to lack of space, but the transformation system introduced to the game recently has the exact same effect on SP recovery as dancing, and you can also move around with that. So you can just turn into something else while you walk towards the entrance of a dungeon. While recovery rate of dancing and transformation is lower the more SP you've got, attack skills are not affected by this decrease. Indeed, the recovery rate while using attack skills scales with the skill XP gain. That is, the more skill XP bonus you've got, and the longer the skill's casting time, the more SP you recover. And there's one more interesting piece of information you might not know yet. Killing monsters that are close to or higher than your character's level also reward you with a bunch of SP. Once again, this only works if you don't have any battle modes active. So a few tips to recover SP faster. Whenever you're about to face a crowd of weak enemies in dungeons, cancel your battle mode to kill them and recover some SP. You can also finish a few easy and fast dungeons like Steamer Crazy and hope you roll more than 5000 SP at the end. 3 runs a day are free to do if, if you use the entries from mailbox after all. And of course there are potions to recover SP if all else fails, which you can either craft or buy from others, but sometimes daily challenge missions give you a few of those too. But if you're short on those and there's a war going on, you can simply join the channel and use spirit gear which is a lot cheaper and doesn't have cool time either. So that's it for today and I hope you learned something new that could help you in the future. Ahoy!